All right, John, about a minute and a half. You're good to go. Hey, it's Steve Tomaszewski. We're getting ready to fire up here just in a few minutes. Uh, so for those of us in the audience tuning in a little bit ahead of time here tonight, hey, I got my glasses on. How's that? I got my glasses on. We're going to be ready to fire up in just about one minute. John Forrest is going to be joining us, some of the young ladies here. What an exciting evening. We just met some people over here. So come on back in about 45 seconds. We're live at the Tilted Tilt in Woodbridge, Illinois. We'll be right back after we play this song from a good friend of ours. What is your name? Timmy? Toby? Toby. And what kind of song you want to sing there, brother? Okay, we're going to see what that is. American Soldier. We'll be right back with the Soldier's Family Radio and TV Talk Show. About a 10 second delay. Start the show with Toby Keith. This is live. You got your phone out, you can be live on the show on your phone. Yep. You don't have the app, we'll send you the app. 30 seconds. So we have two screens just so you can see them, John. I'll put my glasses back on so I can mine. This is a live screen, this is a five second screen. Okay. And let me get the correct spelling of, of your name J O H N F L O R E S. Yep. And when you look at the screen, if you're in the back watching this, this is what they're actually seeing. I've got eight screens going. It's very fuzzy because I'm streaming out the time they come to register. we got about eight seconds here. Three, two, one. Let's get a picture. Let's get a Bring it right in. There you are. There you are. Hey, it's Steve Tomaszewski, and we are live on the Soldiers Family Radio TV Talk Show at the Tilted Kilt in Woodridge, Illinois, on Route 53, with, with our with our new friend, the general manager, my son, right, John Flores? John Flores. Yeah, hey, John Flores! Hey! Just the manager, though. Just Josh, the Josh the GM. So okay, got it all going. Got it all going, right? Yes, yes it's sir. Just to go to it. We're going to have a little, uh, a little fight. What color is that shirt? Is it green or turquoise? It's green, man. It's, it's green. green. Yeah. Okay. Well, all you ladies out there, it's green. Nobody's going, what color is that shirt? Yeah. Come, come into our chat room. And now, John, what's the easy way to get here? Now, I came up 355. But if somebody's coming from Chicago to the first Tilt to Kill, tell us about that. The first Tilt to Kill, Illinois. Yes, we are. Right here. First Tilt to Kill. Uh, we've been here just over three years. And we've been spreading joy and happiness since then. And a beer never looks so good. Beer never, cold beer never looks so good, that's for sure. <laughs> and, and standing on the other side of the camera here, <laughs> young lady who says she's applying for these, the uh, fire department there, right? Yes, she is. Well, you go to it. And every time we walk around, we have story after story after story. Each place we go, a young man over here, a Vietnam vet over here, guys from Australia. And we get calls from Seoul, Korea. It's crazy. It's awesome. And they're like, hey, I saw you when I was, you know, in Mexico. Oh, great. So. John, how did you come to work for the Tilted Hill? How did I come today? Um, one of my buddies suggested a job for me. I came in and I've been here ever since. Wow, that was easy. Yeah, it was pretty simple. So what do you probably put in? Like a thousand hours a week? Oh my god, it seems like <laughs> I live here. You live here, right? I live here. That's, that's what it said. Bedroom, John's room over there. Right? I had something up in the attic. Right oh, now, yeah, yeah, that's a pretty small attic. <laughs> that's a pretty small attic. <laughs> now, each Tilted Hill is here. I tried counting the screens in here. How many bloody screens are there? We have 30 HD TVs. 30, 30, and then we have two uh, projector screens in here as well. Well, those are the big ones back there. Yeah, we got one back there and we got one right over there. Well, you know, it certainly looks like if a company would want to hold an event there, they you must have corporate events here. Oh, definitely. Yeah, so we have a small private room back there that we put our bigger parties in. We actually have one setting up right now. We have 25 people coming in here. 25 people? Yep. Wow! Right now. It's happening. Get them going. Yes, we will. They're going to be here at 7.30, so I'm getting that set up right now for them. And how hard is that to 
to put an event like that together because a lot of people don't know that the Tilt and Kill and our friends, some people from, let's say, the uh, fast driving places, yeah. they want to go someplace different. So they'll go 10 or 15 to go, can we get a little room? How hard is it? And who do they call? It's not hard at all. They can call in, uh, call into the our club here, the phone number 630 Hopefully this, we're going to type that in. Okay, here we go. Ready? Go ahead. Let's, let's read that again. Give me one second. All right, just back up so we can see you. See, there you are. Okay, so now we're going to get a new phone number here for John. Okay, go ahead. Double check to make sure I got the right number. I want to be giving out false information Okay. Tilted. Tilt. Ready to go. Go ahead. So, 630 Okay, let's get that in there. Yeah, they, they can just call up, talk to the hostess. Um, hostess usually can take care of it for them. It's a busier day. The, uh, the manager will we'll talk to him personally on the phone and we'll set something up. Is that right? 969-5458, yes sir. There we go. Okay. Well, one of the nice things, you know what's funny? We meet a lot of the, of the owners of the Tilted Fields and managers like yourself. We're very humble. And around the holidays, people are always patriotic. And then a couple of days, a couple of weeks go by and go, okay. But let me tell you something, folks. We've been doing this for a year and a half. The Tilt and Kill, one of the first companies to stand up. We also do the Bob Norman dealership group, one of the 35 dealerships in the Midwest. With, with Bob, and they actually had their own television and stuff, and they still hire us. So, yeah, we do this show every day. So, every day, 11 a.m. on SFG, I'm going to put that plug in there. <laughs> but, you know, this, this young man, John Forrest, and the Tilt and Kill Wood, Woodridge, so we're trying to find a way to get here from Chicago. Because we're in the western suburbs of Chicago, like Oak Park or Riverside or Maywood. How can we get there from here? You can take 290 West. 290 West. And uh, take that to 355. And you go south on 355. And you can get off on uh, Hobson. And then you just get off on Hobson. You go down to Route 53. You make a right. And go north. Go north on Route 53. Go north on Route 53, yes. And that will be on your left hand side. Race it's kind of a shopping center here, right? The Seven Bridges Movie Theater. Well, there you go. I'm actually there. I'm quite familiar with that. So. I think they should share it in the expensiveness, so uh, they're going to say that and get some money. Uh, you know. <laughs> we so, love that. What was funny, we were with Bob Martin last week, and uh, the guy from Auto Trader came in. So, and he goes, oh, I want to say hello. And he goes, okay, I'll let you check. Two stories, two stories, just to go through. But the folks here, you know, if you have a ton of, of waitresses and waiters here tonight, and, and Boy, they're just like a little busy behind. Yeah, we're going to be filling up here. Dinner time usually comes around 7.30. So we're getting ready for that right now. And also, you said one of the, uh, one of the owners was here tonight, too? Uh, he was. He was floating around. I'm not exactly sure where he is. He might have stepped outside real quick. We're always so humble. We're like, yeah, just go ahead. You know? And, you know, we can't thank you enough, John Floyd, for inviting the soldiers to come down here tonight. Thank you so much. No problem. And we're hoping to make this, you know, an event people start looking forward to. And say, oh yeah, let's, let's go over to the Tilted Kilt in Woodridge on Route 53, and the phone number is 630-969-5458. Call John. Call John. John, how about a shout out to your family and our troops around the world? I guys, I really appreciate it. I personally don't have any family in the military, but I love all you guys. We appreciate everything that you guys do. Uh, it's really awesome. We're actually giving 25% off to any member of the Today we're giving 25% off. We normally give 15% off every single day if you have a military ID. So wow. today we're doing 25% off to anyone who's in the military that comes in. That's outstanding. Thank you for doing it. No John Flores, manager of the Woodridge Tilted Kilt on Route 53, just a half mile north of Hobson Road. You know what? Get off the 355 at Hobson Road. Go west to Route 53, go north to half mile at Seven Bridges, right John? Seven Bridges, yes sir. And, and ask for John. Ask for me, I'm going to be here all night. We're open till midnight tonight. Okay, you're going to be here one while. Alright, yes we are. Okay. Okay. Have some fun. Have yeah. some fun. Thanks again John, good no job. Problem. Good job. Thank you. And that's, that's the show. Captain's over here, Captain's, uh, you know, we were just sitting here talking just a few minutes ago. And a young man uh, came up and they were just talking about a five second play. Sure. And uh, remember your name is Kevin Montgomery. Kevin Montgomery. Yeah. And we're going to put up a screen here. So we're going to show you where you're at. Okay. And we're going to show you a live screen and a five second screen. So here's all sure. your perfect. That's perfect. perfect. Great. Great call to you. Ladies and gentlemen, young man walks in out of nowhere. Right. 
we just talked for 30 seconds and all of a sudden we know almost you know the same people in the 75th training division that have the same time. Wow, that's awesome! That's what awesome. I'm doing. Wow, happy hey, to go, Prescott! Hey, Prescott, how you doing, sir? <laughs> that's amazing. Lieutenant Colonel, how you doing today? Hope you're out there watching. Uh, thank you very much for serving. I, I respect you and, uh, and what you do for uh, our country. And thank you for putting your family aside and, and taking care of business. Well, and you know what? That's what it is, right? It is. And, and the funny thing about that, and the way that came about, is right here. The 75th. Uh, is the 75th uh, insignia that I received. Uh, Major, Major General Jimmy J. Wells, a three-star general, who was on our show, and we're about ready to grab one of the next waitresses who's coming up here. <laughs> and, the, uh, and see how easy this is. Come on okay. in. Come on, Come on in. Introduce right. yourself. And we're going to get you. Let's go to the five-second play. Get ready. Five-second delay. And we're going to put you live. Ready? And let's see. You're right here, so you're going to move on to us a little bit. Yeah, there you are. And what is your name? My name is Carolina. Hi, Carolina. Hi. And how long have you been here? Oh, jeez. Two and a half years. Oh, you're an old timer. Ah, don't say that. Oh, okay. You're a young timer. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. That's, that's right. Can that's I tell right. them what you call me? PMA Yasha. Yeah, PMA Yasha. In Polish. We're drinking Polish. Johnny Walker. <laughs> Johnny Walker is now a Polish drink. Just so you know. It is. I'm okay. There you go. She's in and she's out. No, gotta go, gotta go. Oh, oh, gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Oh, almost got it. I'm just going to come over with one of our new friends. I'm going to be a Vietnam veteran here in a little bit, so I'm going to do it with the young man will be up here in a minute, just to say hello. Kevin, what are the possibilities of you not knowing I on a Thursday in June that we actually know almost the same people? That's hilarious. One in a million. Yeah, if that, right? One in a million, mate. Yeah, if that. If that. And just to come through here. And uh, we were introduced to, uh, at Fort Sheridan, Major General uh, Jimmy J. Wells is on our show. Uh, now down in Houston, Texas, with uh, Lieutenant Colonel Christopher Aycock and uh, Colonel Morbid, who just retired up at Fort Sheridan. And now, your friend, Colonel Prescott. Colonel Prescott actually was talking about uh, Morbid? Yeah, Morbid, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and, and Morbid. Yeah, yeah. So it's a, it's a small world, uh, and, it, and it's great how they pull together. Serve as a uh, really United talk. Force. Force. Mm -hmm. Serve as United Force and, and really bring. Um, value to uh, what we have as freedom in the United States. And it, it, it's amazing. Well, you know, uh, my dad was Army. Uh, I'm not a veteran. My three sons are Army. do this show. But it's young men like yourself that actually, when you say that, that's all that a soldier ever wants. They're so humble. They're just, and they really want to thank you. They just want to know that you know they're there. And right now, Kevin, there's a young man or a young woman out there somewhere in the world, in the Rouge Islands, uh, Cape Town, South Africa, Okinawa, Guam, uh, Vladimir, Russia. Just wonder if anybody really knows or cares that they're out there. What would you like to say to that young man or woman right now serving our country so we can be here tonight? I, I thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. And, and I'm able to come in here today because of your service, your sacrifice, your willingness to give up your family, your, your freedom here in the United States, and, and being able to go to the town with drive through and, That's right. and hang out, That's right. go to the Tilted Kill and have a beer, and uh, serve our country because I can come here and know that nobody is here but as long as these guys are serving. And, and that is priceless. It is priceless. It, it doesn't. Let's get back out in just a few minutes. We're going to get this young man yeah, here. Thank you very Kevin, much. Thanks for being here. Thanks, tonight. Boots. We love you. There you go. That's the show. That's the show. And we, we just keep wondering. We're not going to try to interrupt the dinner over there. But the uh, the small microcosm that's out there tonight, that's just absolutely amazing. That all the people that we see out there and everything that we do, that this show, one of the young men here tonight knows a friend of a friend. And uh, it's, that's how small that, that military those military friends are that we see out there every day. Now, it's not just Army, it's not just Navy, it's not just Air Force, it's not just Marines. How about the Coast Guard? Hey, Coast Guard friends, how are you? We haven't seen you in a while. Come on out to the Tilted Kilt. Tell me what the Coast Guard, Coast Guard Reserves. How about the Merchant Marines? Hey there, men and women in the Merchant Marines. Give us a call on sftvr.com, the Soldiers Family TV and Radio. This is why we're doing it for you. So when you're out there, you can be out in the USS Abraham Lincoln. You can be out on the USS Enterprise. You can be on the, on the USS Ronald Reagan and be on the internet if you have internet. Uh, we get calls and listeners from all the way around the world. Absolutely amazing. We're going to do a quick live stream video check. 
And as we keep going, you're going to start getting some of the waitress to, uh, to come back on, and some of the waiters, and everybody out there tonight. This is the show. So if you have a question about the Tilted Kilt in Woodbridge, let's get that sign up. There it is. Let's get this one up right now. We were just talking with John Flores just a minute ago, general manager of the Tilted Kilt in Woodridge, Illinois. And me, who is that guy? What is that guy's name? Steve? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Hey, it's Steve Tomaszewski at SFTBR.com. Coming up on you. Come right back here. I'm going to drag over here. Come on over. Come on over. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Say hello here now. Look, this is the live stream. There you go. You're right there. You're already on the show. Hi. Hi, Anya. Hi, Anya. Tell us a little bit. We had a good conversation right as we watch it. You know a couple people in the military. Yeah, I know quite a few, actually. Okay. Who are we talking about? Well, my friend Dakota is an army ranger. Well, I'm training to be an army ranger right now, so I'm excited to see you. Go army. Go army. My other friend's in the army right now. Hey Joe, how you doing? Syria, 
out to the up to the Aleutian Islands, out, out to Sydney, Australia. American forces are there all the time, 24/7. They don't get a break. They don't get a vacation. They don't get time off. They stay out on the I'm real. I'm real. Oh, you're right. I'm real. No, I know. They don't. You know. And this is the show. This yeah, is I know. Show. Yeah, you're in. Hey, I get PTO. I get time off. Yeah, I get sick time. I get the share. I get the weekends off. And we're here tonight in Spain and, and those simple words. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. That's, 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 that's all I want to say. Right. 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 Yeah. And, but it, it's so hard though coming from you. I can see it. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I'm not going to date you. you. No, no, no. Okay. We're good. We're good. Believe me, <laughs> we're good. Just go to it. Back again, another young lady join us again. Say hi. 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 Okay, so what's the what's the big drink here tonight? We're about five seconds away, so watch yourself come up. Okay. What, what is one of the uh, last drinks? Rum Oh, rum is very good. Rum chata. What's the Oh, rum is that brand new? That is brand new. Okay, hold this. Okay. Have a move over. Okay. All right, let's get all the ladies in there. All the single ladies. Oh wait, no, no, no. We get it. We get it. There we all go. the single ladies. All the single ladies. Okay, there there you go. All the single ladies. Okay, you can say that you gotta hold the microphone close. Okay. There okay. That's perfect. Alright, so what is what is a rum chata? Rum chata, it's or chata mixed with rum. And how do you say it in Poland? Rum chata. <laughs> ah. Rum chata ski. Yeah, so rum chata. Rum chata with the island is new. Make your drink taste at the bottom of the cereal bowl. Okay, let's say that again. Let's say that again. That's the show. Ramchata. Go ahead, go ahead. Say it again. Ramchata with Rialla's Luffy and the drink will taste the Ooh, I bet it's tasty. Okay, hey. we're in trouble tonight. Hi, Kevin. Hey, troops, we'll have one for you tonight here at the kill. Just to make sure it's okay. Just to make sure it's okay to <laughs> ship overseas for you. Okay. Well, we'll get it over there. No way. We'll get it over there. All right, gotta go. Gotta go. There we okay, go. girls, go ahead on the table. Kevin now, now is our new co-host for here. I just come up. So Kevin, tell us a little bit about yourself. What city are you from? Uh, you know, I've lived here in Lyle just uh, almost five years in August. Okay. And then before that? Atlanta, Georgia. Boy, smoke! Yeah. Go up, Go, go, go pal. Go pal. No problem. Um, I've, I've lived in D.C., San Diego. Uh, just kind of moved around. You're, you're, you're on all military bases. Well, you know, it's funny. My wife's in the whole town with me, so, oh, okay. uh, you know, I drove by, oh, when I lived in San Diego, every day I brought my camp kennel. There you go. And the there you go. You know, sea what, Island. Sea Island. So what's, what's crazy is me, you know, I'm just a, a normal average guy driving down the highway, and I'm going up the, I believe it's a 5 or the 15, and all of a sudden, like, I had the sunroof open, and they're doing stretching goes. Over right there. Right. And all of a sudden, the sun was showing me through all this wind. I look up and go, oh my god, what's going on? And all of a sudden, I find out. I'm new in town. Oh, they're just doing touch and goes. They do it all the time. So it was great. We just pull up the side of the highway and watch them do it. And they had the hovercrafts on the ocean. Love the hovercrafts. They come up on the beach. Oh, it was fantastic. So, uh, more of a respect for the men and women who are serving our country because you see them in action. They're training here to go out and protect us for our freedom. And then when they're refilling the ships with fresh food, they'll bring the Chinooks out, and there's three of them going at one time. So they got one driving, one in transit, one picking up and going, right in Pendleton all the time. It's amazing. I've been there. Miramar right up the street. Oh, well, Miramar, yeah. That's what you're yeah. talking about. And I was about, I was uh, up in um, Rancho Cucamonga. I was in Rancho Pinosquito. Okay. So and, real close. And Rancho Mosquito, too. Oh, Mosquito, yeah. And Carol's Bar. What up, Bob, Bob? Welcome home. All the other good stuff up there. Well, this is us. This is what the show is for. You stay here. I'm going to ask that young man. Yeah. They're not better when you come on the show. Yo, no, absolutely. It's about that drive in San Diego. So it's 91 miles one way every day. And as I uh, went up the, the Pacific Coast area, um, lots of activity with uh, the men and women of the armed forces doing uh, touch and goes. It was just really amazing. And we're going to introduce this young man right now. And your name, sir? Ron Bakuga. Ron? And what's the name of I'm from uh, Green Valley, Arizona. Holy smoke, what the heck are you doing? Can you can join us. Over here in a minute, he's being a little shy. But one of the reasons that we have, uh, we asked you to come by and not just for anything else, 
We always stop the show when we hear those words, Vietnam veteran. And it's because of what you've done, sir, that we, we will stop the show, put our hand out again, and say, welcome home, sir. Welcome home. Absolutely outstanding. What, and which branch of the service? I was uh, in Ar Army Aviation uh, in the 282nd Assault Helicopter, uh, crew chief of gunner, uh, maintenance in uh, Da Nang, Vietnam, 6768. And we have... Uh, Come home. Home safe, guys. We all need to. I need somebody to replace me here in the beautiful Tilted Kill. <laughs> Come on in, guys. Yeah. And you know the Tilted Kill started in Arizona. Yes, yes. And they're still there. And they're still there. Just to go to And you're still here, too. And what's your son in law's name? Son in law's name. And what's your name, Andy? Hey, 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 hey. Because what you do, stay right here, Ron. Don't go anywhere. Bring him in. Kind of squeeze him in there. Andy, let's see. This is the life you're going to see. There you go. Andy, welcome to the show, the Soldier's Family, the Radio Talk Show. Good to be here. Good and in what city are you from? I'm from uh, Donner Grove, right next door. Okay, you got to scoot in just a little bit on the edge. There we are. Okay, okay. Yes, okay. And so, Donner Grove, Friday night, great, great car shows. Yes, yes, I've been down for a couple of them. Okay. Well, but yeah. And so, what made you choose, uh, of all places, with your father-in-law, is that right, Ron? Uh, the Tilted Guild. Uh, we came here once a few years ago and just really enjoyed it, so we thought, can I make beer selection? Beer selection. And the beer selection is great. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, actually it's, it's improved quite a bit since the last time I was here. It's, 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 it's. And what I just found out, this has been here for three years. And the first one in Illinois, so it's kind of exciting. Some of our friends, now next week, I'm going to be announced to you, the Soldier's Family of TV and Radio Talk Show, which will be broadcast at the BFW State Convention. Uh, Terry Vance, Vietnam veteran. Uh, sir, Terry, how you doing, sir? Hey, Terry. Uh, shout out to him. And a young lady, welcome home. And the reason I point that out is a young lady who started to work there 39 years ago. Bonnie Kohler is retired. And we'd like to say to her and you know, all of our Vietnam veterans, all Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, you know, thank you for what you've done. Because we couldn't be here today without you. Yep. I mean, we just love what the guys are doing now. And we all and girls. And girls. Yeah. Are doing now. And the girls. And, and you know what? This young man, we and Eric met before. This comes later. First words out of his mouth. Let me let me. He wants to thank the young people today. Again, Ron, a special thanks to you and, and a welcome home. Sir. A welcome home. Good job. There you go. A real American, a real American hero. Not a word about himself, Kevin. No. Thank you others. Thank you others. Already. Yeah. Not thinking about it. Son of the law, first one is out of the spot. Thank you to the young men and women. Well, he knows what the sacrifice it is to get out there and serve. Again, a moment in time uh, for, for Ron and the soldiers' family. Absolutely outstanding. And, and I can't thank you enough. I can't say thank you enough every day, 24-7. And, and you go, okay, is that enough? They go, okay, leave me alone. And for some of our other friends, and, and it's just not Army, Navy, Air Force, Marine, Coast Guard, Merchant Marines. You know, the Women's Auxiliary at the BFW, constantly, this is, these are all volunteer positions. I believe at the BFW of Illinois, there's over 100,000 members, and only five have paid almost minimum salary to run 100,000 plus people. Yeah, each one of the district commanders, 18 of my name correctly, uh, again, a volunteer position. Our state commander this year, Bill Phillips. Uh, hello, commander. We'll see you next week in Springfield. And we'll do a shop back out for Ron here and his son-in-law, Andy. And it's all volunteer. All of these lodges, all of these halls, all volunteer work. Usually the bartenders do make minimum wage plus tips. Everything else is, is donations. And over, I don't know if you knew this, Kevin. 2.1 million members of the BFW worldwide. Wow. Is that big? Uh, that's that's phenomenal. That's huge. You know what I mean? The BFW Pokemon last year on bike. And uh, it, it, was, it was the one at St. Charles. Oh, hundreds, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hundreds. Hundreds wait, of people. Wait, was it, was it at the Tavia? Uh, uh, it was the Tavia. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, big, big Thunder. Rolling big Thunder. Thunder. That's it. That's it. Our friends out there at Rolling Thunder, Chapter 1. Hawk, how are you doing? Hey, fantastic. And we actually started the show for them. Where is Bo Burkle? United States Army captured 
Afghanistan, June 30th, 2009. And just this past week, at Memorial Day, 500,000 people gathered in Washington, D.C. to say, where is Bo Bergdahl? We don't want to find out six months from now that he's not around or he's still missing. So for all you congressmen out there making $174,000 a year, Congressman Gold, Congressman Walsh, Congressman Kinzinger, Congressman Roscom, we'll go right down the list. Where is Bo Bergdahl? And we're not a Get off your butt and find this guy. 174 grand a year. Get off your butt and find this yeah. guy. Yeah. Let's, let's just say, we don't want to. I don't want to. 20 hey. years from now. No, <laughs> no. I don't want this guy to be some uh, name on the wall. That's right. Let's, let's bring him home now. Let's, let's do it today. See? That's, this is what we're talking about. And, you know. Don't make me angry. Go, go get Kevin angry. I got all. Good to go. Good to go. But that's a great event we have out there. Uh, and it's not me. This year I'll be doing some of the announcing. Uh, but we bring our show out to, to the uh, Wounded Warriors, to the Warrior Watch, the Rescue Riders, the Sons of Liberty, the White, the Rescue Riders, all of them, great motorcycle parts out there. Do you have a bike? I do. Victory Vegas. Oh boy! Yeah. Oh boy! I know the Harley guys don't like it. No, no, it's a great bike. bike. It's lovely. How many CCs? Uh, it's over 1600. Oh, so it's a little more now. It's a car. Yeah, it's a little, yeah, it's fast. Okay. Fast like a board. Yeah, okay. Oh. <laughs> we're going to come up and take a short break, uh, put some music on for you. We've got a little uh, Britney Spears and some Katy Perry coming up. We'll be right there, Kevin, with the Soldiers Family TV and Radio Talk Show right after this announcement. We'll see you. We'll be right back.